Hi, uh, my name is Shashank and I am uh, representing Zinkit and this is my friend Krishna. Yeah, and I'm Dr. Has I represent Dr. Hassan and I have created this truck. Uh, so shall we begin the negotiations, Mr. Shashank? Yes, yes sure. So uh, yeah. as you all know, we have provided uh, you five propositions and for uh, my company and uh, for the, your for your benefit, I believe that the best payoff would be of proposition E, which is uh, paying you $12 million upfront and $20 million in bonus. Uh, just because the sum which you will be uh, getting if the FDA approves the drug is $32 million. Uh, that is what I propose. Yeah, okay. So, uh, Mr. Shashank, it's a very good proposal, but uh, according to me, what, hap what what is happening here is that you are considering here a probability of 0.1 of your drug getting approved. But according to me, it's a very high, high, high chance that the drug will get approved by FDA. So the total amount which you are paying me is quite less and I don't believe that I could accept it. What I am trying to propose is the package B. That is you pay me 20 million upfront, which anyways, which uh, the team Zooms was going to give me. And the, if the FDA approval gives, uh, gets through, then you pay me another 15. Because anyway, you will be making an additional uh, cash flow of around 100 million. So it's uh, better that uh, you, sh you should give me for from that cash flow as well. So. Offer B is what I suggest, and uh, yeah. So, what what is your take on that? Uh, so, my take on that is uh, it is actually one of the propositions which uh, was suggested by your lawyer, and uh, since we would be, uh, it would cost us a fortune to get the FD approved because ten million dollars is just to file it, and as you know, you you told us that it's a point, uh, it's a probability of sixty percent, but uh, my team. Uh, it uh, tested the markets and uh, your drug to be approved by FDA, the probability is just 10% as you know, right? So when you see that uh, it, it all in all, it would cost us a lot of money to go with the proposition B just because upfront we are paying you $20 uh, million and in bonus also we are paying you $15 million. So for if the FDA is not approved, we'll go in a loss of $10 million. And that would not be that would actually not be a good proposition for us to go with it because you know the chances are very low. So what I would suggest is uh, why don't you uh, why don't we strike a deal and we go with the option D, right? In which upfront we are paying you seventeen million dollars, and even if we think of it uh, from your perspective, it was sixty percent. From my perspective, it was ten percent. If we get a middle ground and let us assume that uh, there is a chance of 30% of the, the, the drug getting approved, right? So our both of our expected cutoffs from proposition D becomes huge with respect to uh, B and E option. Uh, these are the second best options that we have. So the B and uh, E option are the first for uh, you and me respectively, but D option is the second best option. and not only uh, it will be uh, it will be beneficial for you uh, talking from Zam's point of view. After you pay your lawyer, you will be getting a value of six point one five million dollars. That is that is huge, right? So I would expect you to uh, ex uh, like go through that offer and see whether it would be beneficial for you or not. Okay, Mr. Shashank, I've done the calculations from my part as well, and I find that your offer is uh, pretty good for me. And uh, I guess that we can reach a deal here. And uh, yeah, so what do you say? We strike a deal here? Uh, it would be great. It would be great to collaborate with you, Dr. Hassan. And uh, I hope, right. uh, and hope uh, it does both good for both of us. And uh, first, of, first of all, we would like the FD to approve our, your draft. Because that would uh, absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. absolutely, absolutely. I hope that the FDA approves and we all make a big profit out of it. Right. Thank you, doctor. Thank you. Thank you.